this session of openmentor.net in this session we are going to see some more features of vi editor let me open the file it shows this file it says awake arise stop not till the goal is reached all the great words of swami vivekananda now i want to do a search forward search i press slash and then say u okay now it goes to the next u you see you could see the cursor right here now if you want to move forward i can pr simply press n i simply press lower case n you can see the cursor moving to the next it was there now it is moving here now i am pressing n it moves here if i want to go backwards i can always do capital n now the cursor has moved here now i press capital n it moves here so you can use small n and capital n invariably and interchangeably if i want to see what is the current line number okay now i say i press control g the moment you press control g look at the last line it says line 8 of 29 totally 29 lines and the cursor is in column 1 now i move the cursor here i place that here now i press control g it says at the last line line 12 of 29 lines column 16 so if you want to know the line and column number on the editor where the cursor is you can use control g if i press shift colon and then press 0 and then hit enter you see the cursor wherever it is it goes to the first line of the file shift colon 0 it will take you to the first line of the file now i say shift colon dollar the moment you say shift colon dollar and then enter it takes you to the last line of the file if you want to scroll up you press control u the moment you press control u look at the cursor here the cursor is on the first line now i press control u and then say control d because it's right at the beginning if you press control d it moves half the screen the cursor comes to half the screen now i press control d again the cursor goes back here half the screen so you can if you can if you want to move back and forth you can use control u and control d same way if you press control f it will scroll by one full page then if i press control b it will scroll back one full page i want to go to the 23rd line my cursor is here now i want to move to the 23rd line shift colon type 23 and then hit enter the cursor goes here this is the 23rd line how do i know press control g you know it displays line number 23 over here suppose my cursor is here and i want to append something at the end of this line press capital a the cursor moves to the last part of the line from here you can type change is the only constant escape press the escape key capital a will append any text to the end of the line now closely watch the cursor is here i am going to press w the moment i press w the cursor is moving to the next word it goes to the next word or the next line available now if i want to move it w will make one line and one word forward if i press b small b lower case b it will go backwards in the same way it will go to the beginning of the word or the line in backwards now i want to undo something for example i undo this i type this now i want to undo this to move out of the insert mode go to press escape key then press u small u the moment you press small u 
it will undo the previous thing so uh, it at the bottom it says one change before this thing and then 11 seconds ago that change had happened so if you press u small lower case u it will undo the stuff now i am going to quit this file now this is the file for your reference just a quick thing i for insert escape key to move out of the insert mode r for replace x for delete dd for delete line yy for copy or yank lines p for paste 0 to go to the beginning of the line dollar to go to the end of the line slash forward search question mark backward search colon 0 shift colon 0 go to the beginning of line shift colon dollar go to the last line colon n go to the nth line w go to the next word b go to the previous word capital a up and at the end of line u undo control u scroll up control d scroll down with these commands you can do a lot more stuff in vi editor with this i stop this lecture here thank you